For the longest of time, I've been looking for resources to learn binary exploitation with a focus on buffer overflows to start preparing for the OSCP. I've scoured through YouTube, Reddit, Medium, and various other platforms, but nothing seems beginner friendly. All of it is hard to wrap your head around. I found people recommending white papers, making your own C++ application, and disabling ASLR, then hacking it. I was like, what the heck even is ASLR? I found a bunch of stuff I didn't understand at that time. At some point, I realized just how hard it is to teach someone else these things once you wrap your head around them yourself. However, there are resources out there that help me get my feet wet and begin my journey with binary exploitation. I still have a lot to learn and I invite you to join me so we can learn together. Here are some of the resources that help me get started. So firstly, I'd like to present to you Buffer Overflows Made Easy by the Cyber Mentor. At this point, if you don't know who the Cyber Mentor is, you're playing with your life. Aight. So he's got a whole series. It's got eight videos. I've watched all of them. And he breaks it down really well, right? Just watch it. You don't have to go through step by step with him unless you want to. But at this point, if you're just getting started, I recommend that you just watch, take notes, and soak in as much as you can because you're probably not going to understand half of it, even though he breaks it down very well. Then, secondly, we have Live Overflow. He's got 50 whole videos. 50. This man is serious, right? He goes into memory corruption and binary, binary exploitation. And he goes into a lot of detail. I haven't watched most of them because at some point I started getting confused. But I suggest if you watch the first eight or ten, I ended up at eight. If you watch the first eight videos, take notes. You don't have to understand everything. You just have to under try to understand most of it. And the core concepts because that's what's gonna help you once you've watched these eight right if you want a lot more in-depth reading you could buy this book or you could find it on Google for free there's a PDF out there right but I bought it this is my LinkedIn by the way I bought the book I've read a couple of pages I'm on page 126 it's a really hard read you really have to concentrate when you're reading this book but it goes into a lot of detail and you'll probably be a guru by the time you finish this book, okay? After this, we have Intro to Pwn Tools, right? This right here, it was the best. I have a video that goes through this room and try hack. Next up, we have Buffer Overflow Prep. This is a room made by Tiberius, if I'm not mistaken. There's 10 machines. So the first task will get your feet wet, right? Show you the methodology, take notes and all that. And then the rest of the tasks will just help you solidify that methodology. The last channel I'd like to mention for now is CryptoCat. This guy's really good at what he does, All right? If you go on his channel and search Pwn, he has a lot of challenges you can walk through with him. Just watch how he thinks, his reasoning, how he solves them. And he just gives a lot of information. So if you take notes, you learn a lot from crypto cat he's got a ton of these videos all right that's all i have for you for now if you've gone through the first two right then let's go through and start intro to pawn tools the book is optional to be honest it's a really hard read but it will help you so i recommend you do get it all right let's get into it i'll catch you there